do you want to choose science as your career stream and are you confused whether science is going to be a correct choice for you then watch the video till end this is sunil sharma here from speed math welcome back to my channel well before i start off have you seen movie called as dangal or chilla party or bhutnath what is common in all these three movies well the director of the movie and the name of the director is mr nitesh tiwari you might have a question ki why i am discussing this think what could be the qualification of mr nitesh tiwari well mr tiwari obtained his btech degree in metallurgical engineering from iit bombay in 1996 yes mr tiwari is a film writer and director but by qualification he is an iit he is an engineer so this is the best example to tell you that you should always have the best qualification and then later on you can develop a career in the same field or you might venture into something else do what you love and love what you do so without any further ado let's begin as rightly said by patrick ness we are the choices we make the class 10 results will be out and then it will be time for you to choose a stream for plus 2 your options are simple you have to choose between taking up science commerce or humanities but it is a short term and long term consequence of the choice you now make that makes it so difficult to choose the choice that you now make can either make or mar your career so which among the three streams should you choose as it so happens science often turns out to be a hot favorite of several students and parents but is it really for you but the biggest question in your mind should be are you cut out for a career in science after class 10 keep the options aside for the time being also keep aside the 100000 different opinions you may have got from parents relatives friends teachers and other well wishers sure they were trying to help but this is your life so the choices you make should also begin with you so probe yourself are you that slightly eccentric geeky guy or a girl in school who is kind of cool but in an uncanny way it's true students who want to take up science as a stream after class 10 have a set personality type most of them are introverts and believe in contemplation they like to spend time by themselves instead of socializing with a lot of people they are committed they have concrete career goals and they really know what they want they are not scared of having to burn the midnight oil they can take the stress they are keenly interested in everything science and they don't mind giving up their play time for fathoming the unfathomable sounds overwhelming well it is you who must choose what you love and then you must love what you choose so let us discuss the must have skills for career in science after class 10 a student planning to take up science should have an analytical bent of mind they must be perpetually inquisitive about things like why the apple fell down on the ground they must naturally take a keen interest in solving problems unveiling mysteries and deciphering the logic behind all phenomena they must have an innate ability to draw a connection between the concepts they study and real life situation they must have the tenacity to work hard and they must be no all but perseverance edison failed 999 times before he actually invented the light bulb If this describes you then by all means science is just the right stream for you. Now the next question is which subject combination should you choose for your 11 12 science? Well, the answer is very simple. Does biology catch your interest? If yes, then it's medical. If no, then it's non-medical. And if it is maybe, then it is both. And accordingly on your screen you will see the different subject combination. Set A students are eligible for medical exam which is called as NEET that is National Eligibility Come Entrance Test. 
set B students are eligible for engineering entrance exam like JEE or MSCT. Set C students are eligible for MHCT, JEE and NEET entrance exams. Between JEE and NEET, if you are not entirely certain, it is best to opt for set C. Students who take up this combination have more number of career options open to them. Here are some career options. There is no such thing as limited career options and even if there was, that definitely does not apply to a student who takes up science after class 10. All you need to know is where you are right now, where you want to go in the future and what is it that you love doing. If you have clarity in these terms, you will always know what is best for you. But not all have all the answers right from the start and that's okay too. Do what you love and love what you do.